since you see a variety of patients, is it quite common that a person's weight gain stems from childhood trauma? Yes, definitely. So this is why when I start consulting my patients for weight management, I usually start from childhood. In fact, I would I usually ask my patients what was their birth weight. So if they have intrauterine growth retardation, that means they have they were a small baby and they were underweight as a baby, they usually end up putting on weight because the genetic mechanism gets switched on and they start to store more food and slowly they start to put on weight. So it's very important to find out if there have been life changing events in the natural history because that's the key. The key is to find out why did you put on weight? What was the reason for putting on weight? So childhood trauma is a huge impact on the person's life. So this is why I ask my patients if they had a happy childhood, if there was any child abuse or there's any accidents or the major operations. Um, so all these things can have an impact on how a person um, puts on weight and their relationship with food. So I'll give you a, a small example of uh, childhood trauma which can affect um, the way you put on weight even as an adult. Child is five years old and the child starts to find out that the parents are separating. So there's a divorce process going on, there's lots of uh, noise in the house, the child is more secluded. And slowly the child finds that it can't seek help or solace with either of the parents and starts to live with the grandparents. So the grandparents look after the child very well, in fact, too well, and start feeding the child to keep the child happy. You know, food is happiness. So the child is fed with lots of snacks, and the child starts to think that food is happiness. So the relationship with food has changed. So whenever you have any problems, you start to eat more. So as the child grows up into an adult, and whenever there's future problems, even as an adult, he or she goes for food. So whatever has happened during childhood dictates what happens in the adult life. And I think that's the case with lots of other metabolic problems as well. So the impact during childhood makes a huge difference on what happens during your adult life. Yes, you're right. And that's why it's important to unravel that and get over it.